the guy says, hey, you're the guy that rides a bike with a big tire across the nuclear power plant. And yeah, this is Labor Day. This is an isolated little beach where I rarely see anybody. I think it is nuclear power plant property. At some point, yeah, nuclear power plant exclusion areas. Let's see what the rest of this sign says. Limited to passage between beach areas north and south in the nuclear power plant. Perfect. A rule made just for me. I've not come here to hang out the warm water discharge of the nuclear power plant. But I do want to connect the two beaches to travel. And these are new signs, by the way. Been doing this for years. Haven't seen these signs before. So who else can do that? Realistically, I've never seen anybody walking doing that. You can't have anything motorized and do that. I've never seen anybody along here with a fat bike. So I think that uh, limits it to me. <laughs> I'm the only one that rules for, applies to, and I comply with. Wow, this is going to be trouble here. You might not be able to see that surf crash. Or I can stop and you can see up ahead what's happened. Uh, surf crashing on this uh, steep section has actually brought down part of the top of this ledge. Now bear in mind i quite prepared for this. I looked at the tide chart before I came. I'm ready for this. I've uh, been very watchful of the tide conditions as I'm riding and the tide comes up here and if the tide does come up here you don't want to be here when that happens. Yeah, see, we got more cliffs falling here. And the key is to just keep moving at this point. Yeah, see? This is what you see down here. <laughs> Used to be up there. I'm good, I'm good. Problem is, <laughs> That's not our only point. Our other point, much worse than coming up. You can, can see the waves crashing on it. In the coming hours, the tide will recede. That point right there will be a walk in the park <laughs> or a walk on the beach. I don't really want a log to come up and get me. Just thinking that's a good thing to avoid. Yeah, this is all kinds of debris. This is not our usual beach. But then you discover after hanging out on the beach enough, there is no such thing as a usual beach. The beach, more than any terrain I know, is in a constant state of flux for obvious reasons. There's a, a humongous and powerful unrelenting force being released on it at all times. And we're looking at it. This is the tip of the iceberg. This is uh, as ferocious as this is. <laughs> um, you can get much more so. Now here we are at a difficult spot. Now this I hadn't anticipated, but I am prepared for, which means <laughs> probably means I gotta turn around and go back. <sighs> that point out there is a big deal. Um, it's very dangerous. Darn. Darn da darn da darn. Darn humongous high tide, high surf. Yeah, look at that. It's crash. Crash. There's no way. No safe way through that. It's constant. All right, I'm heading back. All I've been doing is adjusting myself to the inevitable here. Today, I'm going 
gonna go on a, a ride, but a different kind of a ride, uh, in a different kind of a place, and uh, on a different kind of a bike. There it is, right there.